There are a few different ways to crop an image in WordPress. You can select any part of the image freehand with your cursor. You can crop by aspect ratio. For example, one by one would be a square. 16 by nine is another popular aspect ratio for large desktop monitors and TV screens. Or you can specify exact pixel dimensions. Let's dive in and take a look at each option. To draw a freehand crop, hover your cursor anywhere over top of your image. Click, hold, and drag your cursor to draw a rectangle on the image. Once you release your mouse, you can use the squares located around the edges of your selection to adjust the crop. Place your cursor in the middle of the image, click and drag to move your selection to another part of the image. Once you're happy with your selection, click the crop button. And to save your changes, be sure to click save down below. Now let's say you know the exact dimensions that you need the image to be. For this example, we need our image to be exactly 600 pixels wide and 700 pixels tall. First, draw an area over top of the image. It doesn't matter how big or small, just any area on the image will do. Now we'll come over here to the image crop section. And underneath selection, we'll enter 600 followed by 700. Notice how the selection on the image has changed. It is now exactly 600 pixels wide by 700 tall. You can move it around to crop a different part of the image, and when you've got what you want, just click Crop. The third option for cropping an image is by specifying an aspect ratio. Like I mentioned at the top of this video, a one by one aspect ratio would produce a square. But you can choose any aspect ratio that you'd like. It's completely up to you, and it will depend on your theme as well as personal preference. To achieve a perfect square, under Aspect Ratio, enter one by one. Now, when you go to draw your selection over the image, you'll notice that you can only draw a square. You can make your square larger or smaller, but it'll always be a square. Another common usage of the Aspect Ratio crap might be if you need a wide but short header image. Set your aspect ratio to something like 10 by three, and then make your selection. This would make for a great background image that you could display text on top of. And again, always remember to click save after you're finished cropping. 